Now I want to do a video tonight about another video that I saw in regard to a chap from Noosa that refused an RBT and questioned the validity of law that uh, sorry the police were Queensland police were relying on. So then the matter went to the court and I'll actually I'll put a link of the video in in um, not the description in the comments. So now this matter went to court, went to like a magistrate court. This guy had been studying his law for a little while. He came up with like high court cases and so forth and so on, gave it to the magistrate. And the magistrate basically didn't acknowledge it, any of it. So it was high court cases. And he put it to the magistrate that, well, you're a lower court, so you should follow higher court rulings. The magistrate didn't comment on that. And the reason why they don't follow high court rulings is because they're a civil court. They're not actually a court of all, at all. Like it's a like it's a it's a court as in like you know play play a game court that's what type of court they are it's let's play a game so it's a civil court now so he put these statements towards the um, magistrate and you'll see it in the middle of the video and take notice the chap the chap said the magistrate said can we not just be civil about this? I picked up on that straight away. What the magistrate is referring to is civil law. And I'm assuming that the, the guy's response would have been, well, I am, sir, or I, like, I thought I had been, sir. So now the magistrate's going, oh, okay, well, you've entered into the civil law jurisdiction now. Before you, were, before you were actually um, arguing, actually arguing law, and that's got nothing to do with me. I don't really care about the the law. I just, all I want you to do is contract with me. So um, yeah, so the magistrate goes, well, can we just be civil about this? Well, that's what the quote was anyway. So watch the video and see what you think about it all. Now. What I do nowadays, and I haven't had any fines for a while now, but like even that last time when I got roughed up by Victoria Police, they didn't even really want to send me any fines or any charges or any of that shit fuckery. Because I think they know, they know I'm onto them. They know that I'm onto their fraudulent claims. So it's all interesting. Like they only sort of had me under like um, unlawful arrest for probably five minutes because I was like ripping into them big time like basically t like telling them off like basically they're, they're violating my rights and they like if you don't stand up to a rights violator there's an assumption that you agree with it so have a look at this video because I think you'll find it's interesting and if you've got any comments just put them in the comment section and like maybe the haters maybe try to keep your comments to some other video right because you'll just get blocked but anyway knock yourself out and um, Halsbury's laws of England state that a magistrate court cannot be legitimized as per constitutional constraints so it would therefore go to reason that a magistrate court is le illegitimate so it would therefore go to reason that a magistrate court is merely a commercial entity operating in equity all right watch the video make some comments cheers bye